The Philippine Army is gearing up to receive the second wave of armored vehicles, Warani 6x6, from Brazil, as part of its efforts towards military modernization and capability enhancement. Following the successful first shipment on February 18, 2024, which involved the delivery of five units of Guarani Armored Personnel Carriers APC, the Philippine Army has once again partnered with Brazil to secure the second wave shipment. The Guarani 6x6 armored vehicles have proven to be a valuable asset to the Philippine Army since the first shipment. Developed by the Brazilian military company, the use of Guarani APCs has enhanced the mobility, protection, and combat power of the Philippine Army in various operational scenarios. It is expected that the second wave shipment will arrive in the Philippines by the end of 2024. Philippine military officials have ensured that they are ready to welcome the arrival of the new armored vehicles and will promptly integrate them into active service after the completion of inspection and preparation processes. The cooperation between the Philippines and Brazil in procuring Guarani 6x6 armored vehicles not only strengthens the bilateral relations between the two countries but also enhances the national defense capability of the Philippines amidst the evolving security challenges in the region. The Philippine Department of National Defense DND, has placed an order for 28 armored personnel carriers APC, Warani 6x6 from Elbit Systems, solidifying its commitment to bolstering the country's defense capabilities. The partnership between the Philippine DND and Elbit Systems reflects a mutual commitment to defense cooperation and technology transfer. The procurement of Guarani 6x6 APCs represents a strategic investment in strengthening the country's defense infrastructure and safeguarding its national interests. As the geopolitical landscape continues to evolve, the Philippines remains steadfast in its dedication to maintaining peace and stability in the region. The acquisition of these modern armored vehicles reaffirms the country's resolve to protect its sovereignty and ensure the safety of its citizens. The arrival of these Guarani 6x6 APCs signifies a significant leap forward in the Philippines' defense modernization efforts. With their deployment, the country gains invaluable assets capable of fulfilling a diverse range of roles, including troop transport, reconnaissance, and urban warfare operations. Moreover, the acquisition of the Guarani APCs underscores the Philippines' commitment to bolstering its defense capabilities and safeguarding its national interests. As regional security dynamics continue to evolve, these advanced armored vehicles will play a pivotal role in ensuring the country's readiness to respond to emerging threats and challenges. The delivery of the Guarani 6x6 APCs not only strengthens the Philippines' defense capabilities but also deepens the strategic partnership between the Philippines and Brazil. It highlights the mutual commitment of both nations to fostering cooperation in the defense sector and promoting regional stability. As the Philippine military integrates these Guarani APCs into its arsenal, it signals a new era of enhanced readiness and preparedness to tackle the complex security landscape in the Asia-Pacific region. With their arrival, the Guarani 6x6 APCs stand poised to make a lasting impact on the Philippines' defense posture, ensuring the nation's ability to safeguard its sovereignty and protect its citizens effectively. Techno Defesa reported that these vehicles are part of an initial contract for 28 units destined for the Philippine Army, with an estimated arrival date at their final destination, the Port of Manila, set for mid-December. The agreement stipulates that all vehicles covered by this contract must be delivered by the second half of the coming year. The VBTP Mr. Guarani Armored Personnel Carrier Vehicle, medium-wheeled type, is a 6x6 armored personnel carrier developed by Iveco and the Brazilian Army as part of its Uru-23 modernization program aimed to replace all EE-11 Uru-2 by 2015. Other Brazilian companies also participated in the program, such as Imbol, Communications, Elbit, Armaments, Usaminas, and Vilars, 
Development of National Ballistic Structural Steel VBTP Mr. Guarani is powered by Iveco's Cursor 9 turbocharged diesel engine, developing 383 horsepower and coupled to an automatic transmission. The vehicle has a hydropneumatic suspension. Modular side floats can be added for improved flotation. The baseline APC can be airlifted by AC-130 Hercules. The vehicle has a crew of two and is designed to transport nine troops.